Hey guys, what's up? This is Redison from Team AA, and today we are going to talk about the Galaxy Note 9. We know the Galaxy Note 9 will be big, but will it be much different from the Note 8? If the recent tweet from the notable smart Leaker IC Universe is going to be believed. The upcoming Note 9 will near be familiarize its predecessor. He states the only difference between two devices is a 2mm difference that is nearly impossible to notice unless comparing the devices side to side. While it's impossible to verify these claims, the Ice Universe has a good track record with Samsung leaks. On the other hand, Dutch tech side Let's Go Digital believes that the Note 9 will more look like iPhone X. The site found a patent for the Samsung that was approved in the March 2018 for a device that looks a lot like iPhone X. The phone has the controversial top notch and no apparent fingerprint sensor. So coming to the in-display fingerprint sensor, Samsung has not done any official statement about the in-display fingerprint sensor um, because it may be not a mature enough technology to be used in a Samsung device. Maybe you're going to see this in a Google Pixel. So design-wise, there is not much of a difference in the Galaxy Note 9 as compared to the Galaxy S uh, Note 8. It is just like a bit of improvement like we saw in the S9 from the S8. And and you're going to see the good hardware that you are seeing in the S9. You're going to see the Exynos 9810 chipset or the Snapdragon 845 in the US. And you're going to see 6 and 8 gigs of RAMs variant. And another surprising news about this time is that the Galaxy Note 9 series will be having uh, 256 and 512 GB variant as well. Now this is really controversial but it is really good to have that much of uh, storage available and it will be good for a flagship device. So the Bixby 2.0 is set to make its debut in the Galaxy Note 9 and the Galaxy Note 9 will be featuring Android Oreo 8.1 and not the Android P sadly and suddenly when we got to know that this device is going to release really really soon we are really excited so let's see what Samsung makes and one thing is for sure that Samsung is not going for the in display fingerprint scanner obviously we are not 100% sure but this is the news we are getting everywhere that Samsung is not going for the in display fingerprint scanner it is just a bit of an improvement from the Note 8 and apparently there is nothing big or huge thing to be surprised unless you're going for the S Pen or the bigger battery size or the bigger screen 6.3 inches there is not much big of a difference here so this was the Razor Sun from Team AA and I'm signing out peace out